So Leute, willkommen zu einem neuen Video auf unserem Kanal. Heute gibt es einen neuen Vlog und zwar über die U23 DM, die letzte von Henry. Mal schauen, was wird. Wir nehmen euch ein bisschen mit und zeigen euch ein paar Eindrücke. Let's go! So for English speaking guests, I finished my one hour ride. Easy spinning, 200 watts, 240 normalized power, two times three minute intervals, uh, nice weather. One day before the German Nationals under 23, we are hyped, but we don't expect a result. We just go here for fun. I have problems with my hip, so uh, it still is like a noise while I'm riding, you know. So like when I push, like my whole leg goes numb. Um, maybe after the race we need to find a solution, but at the moment it is what it is. When we go for the stripes, eh? always go for the stripes. See you tomorrow. Good morning guys, it's race day, I'm not having slept the best, my hoop says I'm feeling bad, 20% recovery but doesn't matter because in the race we give 100% you go to the breakfast. Uh, for those wondering where we are, we are in Austria and the race is in Switzerland and we are from Germany. So, Francis is done. Um, good feeling for the body. Makes feel tired now before the race already. It stopped raining unfortunately. But we're gonna full send it to the wind. So, we're packing the car, then we head off to Switzerland, we need to buy a pass for the highway that we are allowed to drive there and then we go to the start. I don't know if I can see the racetrack before the start, but we will see in the race, uh, maybe I don't know the corner, so I will go full send it, but <laughs> we will see. Uh. So we arrived in Switzerland in our team bus. Team Zyger Hospital when I'm gonna pin on my numbers, then I'm gonna eat some pasta and then we will see if I'm ready for the race or not. So guys, I'm in the feeding zone for Henry, you can see me in the office interest, um, but he know where we are standing. Um, we will give him some food and drinks for the next maybe nine rounds, so he can stay hydrated and hopefully get a good finish from the race. And yeah, he's trying his best, he looked good on the bike today. So you can see our bottle change in the following clip. Um, yeah. He still looks good, he's in front group, so the German um, yeah, favorites are also in the front group, mostly of them, so at least three out of four are in the front group, and yeah, hopefully they will go together, and if they go together, they can come to the finish. We have seven, seven runs to go. Sun is really burning so uh, have a little bit of ice will be good for him to cool down and yeah we will see the next round let's go also guys we're clearly going to the last round so at least i had 40 seconds to the front riders three guys um yeah 
will be a hard race. He got the final bottle from me with some coke. Come on, come on, Henry. So German champs done, what a hard race, what a brutal race, that's how I liked it, but fourth place, place in the German, it's quite okay, yeah. you could come always for more, but with circumstances, next time more to come. So guys, now we are on our way back home from the race in Switzerland. Um, I just want to give a short update for the race, um, it started with 160, 170 right? Oh, my nose burned. With 160, 170 riders, uh, 100 Germans, 60 from Swiss, 20 from Luxembourg. So okay, that doesn't calculate much, but um, yeah, it started weird. No one really wanted to attack, and then the big team started attacking with all the men they had, just tried to follow moves, and then they went like 12 guys. I was not in. So I jumped with some Swiss riders, but then the whole peloton jumped. And after that move, the front split it and we were there with like 15, 16 riders. 10, around 10 from Germany and around six <laughs> from Switzerland. And uh, no Luxembourg in it. And then, yeah, we were just cruising along. And uh, there were like four Radnet Rose riders and uh, three Lotto Kenner, so also four. So after a corner, they went full with three riders and behind they blocked and I didn't, uh, I wasn't in front at the moment, so I didn't head it. And uh, yeah, they went directly and I like directly gap from 30 seconds and in the back no one really chased. So I went full on the climb, um, which suited nothing, but on the false flat afterwards, when there was like tailwind, I went again and no one could follow and then there were two guys from Lotto Canals and from Radnet joining me so they were not working um, so I was like left alone in the middle. One, another German caught up and three or four Swiss riders and we nearly closed the gap again, it was like less than 20 seconds so we nearly could ch jump to them. But then the two little guys from Switzerland stopped pacing because they just focused on their own title. So I was there again, left in no man's land. So in the end, the fourth place was uh, the best I could do about it. And I got sixth overall, which I'm really happy. After my break and uh, feeling was good, power was good. Now we go to CBU tour. On Wednesday um, I just wanted to say thanks for everyone who watched this vlog and thanks to the Team Cyclocross Batal crew my mom my father and Oscar for the perfect service during the race that's why I could perform on the highest level today um, thanks for watching watching we see you in the next video bye Wochenende Wochenende